family all here. Come on, this is gonna be great. How can I believe this actually can work out? Nova was such a failure. It wasn't a failure. And it wasn't even your fault. But this is a fresh start, so let's make the most of it. What if this was all just a waste of time? So you've got the three of us now, so there's no way we can fail. The stars are aligned. <laughs> What's up, guys? That's the last of it, right? Yeah, you want to give us a hand? Yeah, no problem. I'm just glad we're all finally here. Yeah, me too. Yeah. How's Orion been running? Orion's been running all right, but I got some inconsistencies to show you. What, did the machine blow up or something? Just a few inconsistencies. I have some results to show you when we get inside. It's making me nervous. Wow, and that's a serious offer? I agree. I'll, uh, I'll have to go over with my team, but that, that sounds great. All right, I'll see you on the six, Mr. Blackwell. Yeah, man, I don't know. I think there's something with the magnets. I let it run a little longer to see if things would even out, but I didn't want to overload the system. Yeah, that's odd. This never happened before we moved in. What do you think, lead in the paint? Well, lead's not magnetic, but it doesn't explain all the inconsistencies. Well, maybe this house was built on some crazy geomagnetic field or something. Well, whatever the case may be, we're all here now. So we know what we came to do, so let's put our heads together and get this job done. We have a chance to do something really great. Let's grab it. Let's do it. Let's do it. I can't believe this guy tried to sabotage three years of Jonas's work. I know, but don't worry. In the next life, he's coming back as a piece of shit fly. <laughs> yeah. And I've got my fly slaughter right here. So the machine's working fine, but you seem a little off. No, I'm fine. I just keep thinking about Orion and what we're going to do when we finish it. I just want to make everyone happy, you know? Maybe give it away, let the world do with it what they will. Sounds like you have your answer. Yeah, but if we do that, how would we be able to afford paying back Michael? With, without him, we couldn't have paid for all this. But at the same time, how do you sell something that you've been working so hard to create? Nick and I have been working on this for forever. And would the world be able to even handle this? It kind of makes me think of Alfred Noble you know, the guy who invented dynamite. He wasn't thinking about defeating the enemy and taking lives. He was thinking about defeating the mountain and connecting them. But we all know how that turned out. You're already thinking about the Nobel Peace Prize. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. <laughs> Smoke? Yeah. You got this. So, what kind of social medium are you conforming to today? I'm actually checking the stock market. Even worse, how can you live your life constantly connected to that thing? My life is just fine. Besides, it's guys like this that are going to make us rich. What, another corporate pansy? As if the world doesn't have enough of those already. Heaven forbid society commence the working class for thinking outside the box. This corporate pansy is one of the most powerful men in engineering and could cut us a check for millions. And who do you think got us a meeting with them? You what? You can't crucify me for giving us more options. That's all this is, another option. What happened? Michael has a deal to sell Orion. We actually have something that could do some good for the world, and you just want to wash your hands of it? All your suits are the same. 
How could you just go behind our backs like that? We're talking about doing this together. Do you have to ask permission before running code? Stop accusing me of going behind your backs. My job is to find investors for Orion. Please tell me how I crossed the line. You could have told us about it first. Let's settle this. What are we going to do with Orion? No, 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 no. This isn't a grip decision. This is Jonas's invention. We're going to do what he wants to do. <laughs> Listen, we're all damn near broke. We spent the last of our money on the house and the equipment. I took a leap of faith. All you do is talk about money. I can't, I can't work with this guy. I can't work with this guy.